Well, welcome everyone. We are glad you're here. Um, this is our uh, live Facebook evening prayer, but it's also the opportunity we have to record and post this office to YouTube. So if you're watching on YouTube, <laughs> actually you're watching the show before the show. And uh, of course, we always have a magic question as we welcome you here. And I'm doing my bit to get the uh, to get things going on our Facebook page. So the uh, question of the night is, if you could watch any movie tonight, what would be your movie? Mm. And and it's Thursday night, you know, the work week is almost over, could be a classic, could be just regular mind numbing nothing, it could be anything. What would it be tonight? I know where I'm going. Yes. The Scottish movie. The Scottish movie. There you go. Yeah. Who's but who's your star? Who's who's, um, who's your Wendy Hiller? Wendy Hiller and Livesey. Roger Livesey. Roger yeah. Livesey. Very good. Did I pronounce it right? The uh, Livesey? It's Livesey. But Livesey. it works. It works. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hi everyone. Hello, Amy. <laughs> Hi. Good evening. <laughs> Well, that's a great one. I like that. Laura, how about you? I don't have a title, but definitely, definitely mind, mindless, happy, happy, mindless fluff. Oh, perfect. Yeah, well, I'm actually, you know, where I'm at is I, I, I might need a, uh, an old fashioned um, mystery movie. So either um, from the Lone Wolf series um or a bulldog drummond or if i might even go totally classic and hit an old sherlock holmes yes yes with basil rathbone there's that's no right <laughs> or that's leslie actually, howard that's how we sometimes how we fall asleep at night yeah because we put on the old basil rathbone <laughs> nigel bruce yes. uh radio shows yes yeah, i'm not sure if i would do something completely silly like airplane uh, or something uh, um, series um Hold more, on, I gotta um, turn down the media. What'd you say? So something completely silly and mindless like Airplane or or a Gene Kelly. Oh. Uh, yeah, we saw CoverGirl a couple over the weekend. So something something like that. I want to see. Oh, okay. I haven't seen On the Town in a while. Anchors Thank away. You. Oh, so you need like a like a like a fluffy. Uh, yeah. Like a fluffy one. Okay. Well, there you go. Um, if you are watching on YouTube, we are glad you are here. If you're, if you're watching on Facebook, we're glad you're here. If you have any intercessions, please feel free to share those. Um, and I will take us to the office. So welcome all. We are glad you're here. Laura, it's your show. Okay. Yours is the day, oh God. Yours also the night. You established the moon and the sun. You fixed all the boundaries of the earth. You made both summer and winter. Let us confess our sins against God and our neighbor. Most merciful God, we confess that we have sinned against you in thought, word, and deed by what we have done and by what we have left undone. We have not loved you with all our whole heart. We have not loved our neighbors as ourselves. We are truly sorry and we humbly repent for the sake of your son, Jesus Christ, have mercy on us and forgive us that we may delight in your will and walk in your ways to the glory of your name. Amen. Almighty God, have mercy on us. Forgive us all our sins through our Lord Jesus Christ. Strengthen us in all goodness and by the power of the Holy Spirit, keep us in eternal life. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Please join me for the invitatory. O gracious light, pure brightness of the ever-living Father in heaven, O Jesus Christ, holy and blessed, now as we come to the setting of the sun, and our eyes behold the vesper light. We sing your praises, O God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. 
You are worthy at all times to be praised by happy voices, O Son of God, O giver of life, and to be glorified through all the worlds. Our Psalms this evening, Psalms 114 and 115. I will lead with the odd verses. You guys respond with the even. When Israel went out from Egypt, the house of Jacob from a people of a strange language. Judah became God's sanctuary, Israel his dominion. The sea looked and fled, Jordan turned back. The mountains skipped like rams, the hills like lambs. Why is it, O sea, that you flee? O Jordan, that you turn back. O mountains that you skip like rams, O hills like lambs. Tremble, O earth, at the presence of the Lord, at the presence of the God of Jacob. Who turns the rock into a pool of water, the flint into a spring of water. Not to us, O Lord, not to us, but to your name give glory, for the sake of your steadfast love and your faithfulness. Why should, Why should the nations say, where is their God? Our God is in the heavens. He does whatever he pleases. Idols their are idols are silver and gold, the work, of human, the work of human hands. They have mouths, but do not speak, eyes, but do not see. They, they have ears, ears but do hear. not hear, and noses, but do smell. not smell. They have hands, but do not feel, feet, but do not walk. They make no sound in their throats. Those who, Those make, who make them are like them, so, so are, are all who trust, trust in them. O Israel, trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. O house of Aaron, trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. You who fear the Lord, trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. The Lord has been mindful of us. He will bless us. He will bless the house of Israel. He will bless the house of Aaron. He will bless those who fear the Lord, both small and great. May the, Lord May the Lord give you increase, you and both children. you and your children. May you be blessed by the Lord who made heaven and earth. The heavens, the heavens are, are the Lord's heavens, the but earth the earth he has given to beings. human beings. The dead do not praise the Lord, nor do any that go down into silence. But we will, but we will bless, bless the Lord, Lord from this time on and, and forevermore. More. Praise, praise the, Lord. the Lord. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Reading from Paul's letter to the church in Colossus. Peter, an apostle of Christ Jesus by the will of God, and Timothy, our brother, to the saints and faithful brothers and sisters in Christ in Colossae, grace to you and peace from God our Father in our prayers for you. We always thank God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, for we have heard of your faith in Jesus and of the love that you have for all the saints because of the hope laid up for you in heaven. You have heard of this hope before in the word of the truth, the gospel that has come to you. Just as it is bearing fruit and growing in the whole world, so it has been bearing fruit among you, yourselves from the day you heard it and truly comprehended the grace of God. This you learned from Epaphras, our beloved fellow servant. He is a faithful minister of Christ on your behalf, and he has made known to us your love and in the spirit. For this reason, since the day we heard it, we have not ceased praying for you and asking that you may be filled with the knowledge of God's will and all spiritual wisdom and understanding so that you may lead lives worthy of the Lord, fully pleasing to him as you bear fruit in every good work as you grow in the knowledge of God. May you be made strong with all the strength that comes from his glorious power and may you be prepared to endure everything with patience while joyfully giving thanks to the Father who has enabled you to share in the inheritance of the saints in the light. He has rescued us from the power of darkness and transferred us into the kingdom of his beloved son, in whom we have redemption, the forgiveness of sins. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Our first canticle this evening, the Song of Mary, the Magnificat. Together. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day, all generations will call me blessed. 
The Almighty has done great things for me and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. A reading from John. On the third day, there was a wedding in Cana of Galilee and the mother of Jesus was there. Jesus and his disciples had also been invited to the wedding. When the wine gave out, the mother of Jesus said to him, they have no wine. And Jesus said to her, woman, what concern is that to you and to me? My hour has not yet come. His mother said to the servants, do whatever he tells you. Now standing there were six stone water jars for the Jewish rites of purification, each holding 20 or 30 gallons. Jesus said to them, fill the jars with water. And they filled them up to the brim. He said to them, now draw some out and take it to the chief steward. So they took it. When the steward tasted the water that had become wine and did not know where it came from, though the servants who had drawn the water knew, the steward called the bridegroom and said to him, everyone serves the good wine first and then the inferior wine after the guests have become drunk, but you have kept the good wine until now. Jesus did this, the first of his signs in Cana of Galilee and revealed his glory and his disciples believed in him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Our second canticle is the Song of Simeon. Together, Lord, you now have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Creed. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen that this evening may be holy, good, and peaceful. We entreat you, O Lord. That your holy angels may lead us in paths of peace and goodwill. We entreat you, O Lord. That we may be pardoned and forgiven for our sins and offenses. We entreat you, O Lord. That there may be peace to your church and to the whole world. We entreat you, O Lord that we may depart this life in your faith and fear and not be condemned before the great judgment seat of Christ. We entreat you, O Lord. Lord. That we may be bound together by your Holy Spirit in the communion of the ever blessed Virgin Mary, blessed Peter, our patron and all your saints and trusting one another and all our life to Christ. We entreat you, O Lord. Lord. O oh God, by the leading of a star, you manifested your only Son to the peoples of the earth. Lead us, who know you now by faith, to your presence, where we may see your glory face to face, through Jesus Christ our Lord, 
who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. Lord Jesus, stay with us, for evening is at hand and the day is past. Be our companion in the way. Kindle our hearts and awaken hope that we may know you as you are revealed in scripture and the breaking of bread. Grant this for the sake of your love. Amen. O God and Father of all, whom the heavens adore, let the whole earth also worship you, all nations obey you, all tongues confess and bless you, and men and women everywhere love you and serve you in peace through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. I invite your prayers of intercession and thanksgiving. Give thanks that Ralph Evans is feeling better today. We pray for all those who are sick with COVID, all their families and caregivers. We pray for all those who are sick with all kinds of illness, all kinds of pain. We pray for healing. We pray for reconciliation and peace in our land. May we find may we find conversation and reconciliation towards healing. We find a way back to back to unity through the love and grace of our Lord and Jesus. O oh God, you made us in your own image and redeemed us through Jesus, your son. Look with compassion on the whole human family. Take away the arrogance and hatred which infect our hearts. Break down the walls that separate us. Unite us in bonds of love and work through our struggle and confusion to accomplish your purposes on earth that in your good time, all nations and races may serve you in harmony around your heavenly throne through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please join me for the general thanksgiving. Almighty God, Father of all mercies, we, your unworthy servants, give you humble thanks for all your goodness and loving kindness to us and to all whom you have made. We bless you for our creation, preservation, and all the blessings of this life, but above all for your immeasurable love and the redemption of the world by our Lord Jesus Christ for the means of grace and for the hope of glory. And we pray, give us such an awareness of your mercies that with truly thankful hearts, we may show forth your praise, not only with our lips, but in our lives, by giving up ourselves to your service and by walking before you in holiness and righteousness all our days. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit, be honor and glory throughout all ages, amen. Almighty God, you have given us grace at this time with one accord to make our common supplication to you. And you have promised to your well-beloved son that when two or three are gathered together in his name, you will be in the midst of them. Fulfill now, O Lord, our desires and petitions as may be best for us, granting us in this world knowledge of your truth and the age to come, life everlasting. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thanks be to God. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen. 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 Well, thank you, everybody. This was quite a quite an extraordinary week. First week back of the new year. It is uh, it is good to have spent it in prayer and in fellowship. We. Uh, we're off tomorrow and taking our Sabbath rest, Father, and uh, and Saturday we uh, will be at, back together Sunday at ten a.m. for our our Holy Eucharist. Um, join us live on Facebook and later in the day on YouTube, and we will be together again for daily office on Monday at nine a.m. for morning prayer and five p.m. for evening prayer. If you are on Facebook, uh, join, a, create a watch party. And if you are on YouTube, like and subscribe and ring that bell and have a blessed weekend and a blessed rest. We'll see you guys on Monday. Bye-bye.
Take care. God bless. <laughs> bye bye.